It is Tuesday, I think, January 17th, I think. Uh, we're here to do a back workout with Anthony and Sam, two of my clients. Um, this is kind of a, a down phase for me in training. I'm not really trying to gain, just trying to maintain what I have, trying to get a little healthy. Um, but I'm still going to crank up some intensity. I don't want to lose all my gains. So uh, we're going to hit it hard today, and uh, that's about it. So let's go get it done. Starting back out here with some neutral grip pull downs. Um, I like this over a normal pull down. I feel a lot better connection with my lats. Um, just kind of getting warmed up right now. Put to three working sets here, and then we'll get on to uh, a rowing movement. I think we'll do uh, the hammer low row out back. Uh, we'll do another pull down movement, and then either some deadlifts or. Uh, some bent over row type movement next, and then we'll go from there and see how I feel. When you're training partners take off and you don't spot you, you do drop sets. Lunchbox stolen, which had the contents of my house key, my car keys, my wallet, all my supplements, a spare battery charger, my food and everything. Got done training, so I was gone. I had to cancel four clients because I had no food, had no way of getting anything. Uh, then this morning on the way to the gym, I had a gigantic pothole and cracked both of my fucking rims. And uh, here I am, trying to get a workout in. Oh, later today I have an MRI on both my elbows too, because those are totally fucked. So, life's awesome right now. So we're just gonna lift some fucking weight. All right, so exercise number two, we're doing a DY low row uh, with a reverse grip. I love this for focusing on lower lats which suck on me, so I gotta put a lot of emphasis on that. Between this and bent over row type stuff, hopefully I can get those bad boys to thicken up. I'll do three working sets here, and uh, move on to another pull down movement. I like to alternate rows and pull downs, so we're gonna do a pretty balanced workout today. The past couple weeks I've been doing primarily just uh, row type movements to get some more thickness. Um, I'm going to mix it up a little bit today and work on some pull downs, wide grip type stuff. Work on a little width too, as well as the, uh, the rowing for the thickness. next exercise which is a metaphor for my life uh, the hoist machine pull down it's a roller coaster up and down a ride uh, which is my life of good luck and bad luck but no I love this machine it keeps constant tension all the way through uh, I can really hit different parts of my lats you know because of the control of it you can either lean back more and hit more of your lower back you can sit upright more hit more of your upper lats uh, I'm gonna focus on a little bit of higher lat 
I gotta get a little more thickness, let them pop out from underneath the armpits a little more. So we're gonna get in three working sets here, and then uh, figure out some type of deadlift movement maybe. All right, so now we're gonna do uh, some deadlifts off the floor. It's been uh, it's been a minute since I've actually deadlifted. I think the last time I did any deadlifts was uh, on the photo shoot with Arnold. Before that, it was probably before my shows, sometime in early November, late October. So it should be fun. I plan on uh, three sets, and I'll probably be winded and want to cry, and crawl out of here. Remember those old videos that I used to do last year? When it was called Deadless and Diarrhea? Yep, I got one more set, then I gotta go run and take a shit. I do deadlifts, I get like a nervous reaction. Heavy squats and deadlifts, I always gotta poop and puke usually. So I did the poop, the puke might come next. It's not TMI, it's just life. I'm doing a Disney show next Friday night. I'm airing. It's gonna be uh, quite the uh, the outfit that I have to wear. It should be a funny skit, I'm excited about it. Probably one of the the coolest commercial slash TV shows I've done. So hopefully you'll see that. Maybe like a month or so will be out, if not less. But uh, trying to become a, a Disney TV star. Be the next rock. some rope pull downs, call it a day. We, uh, we move some fucking weight, some deadlifts. The boys push themselves, I push myself. So I'm content, not a big volume day, but we got some work in. So I lied and decided we're gonna superset rope pull downs with uh, rope low rows. And I'm setting up across from each other. That way we can look into each other's eyes while we're training and uh, just kind of whisper sweet nothings to each other. Motivate each other, get us all worked up and hot and heavy. Now 
right, so that concludes today's uh, back workout. Um, as I said, I'm kind of in a phase right now where I'm not really trying to accomplish anything. I'm trying to let my body heal a little bit. I'm taking a few more rest days a week. Eating's been kind of moderate. Um, you know, just, just trying not to lose a lot that I put on my weights. Still hovering in the 250s. Still relatively lean. Um, I'm actually gonna start dieting for the next few days. Like I said, I got a, uh, a TV show that I'm filming next Friday for uh, Disney. That's gonna be pretty exciting. So I'm gonna be in a little tiny tank top. Well, actually, I'm gonna be pretty much nothing. So I wanna look decent for that. And uh, probably gonna start, well, I gotta start some athletic training. I kept saying a while ago that I'm gonna try to get out to the track and start running and things like that, but I've had some miscellaneous injuries popped up. It's been cold as hell outside here. No way I wanna go to the track and start sprinting it when it's 45, 40 degrees out, uh, you know, when I'm first getting back into it. So uh, I found a training facility down in the South Bay that has some AstroTurf. I'm just waiting for uh, my buddy Heath Evans, ex-Patriots player, to uh, get done with his little mini diet that he's doing. I mean, I'm gonna get down to the track and start doing some stuff. Try to be big old athletes again. Um, so that'll be some exciting content coming your way. And then I'll probably start kicking off uh, kind of a growth phase, uh, second week of February maybe. So I really wanna give my body a little bit of a break, but again, that's all depending on, I'm getting an MRI today on both my elbows. My left one's completely fucked. Uh, I have what feels like a little piece of tendon torn off or a bone spur or something there. It's just affecting everything I do. So, you know, depending on what the MRI results say and uh, what the ortho says on what treatment's gonna be, you know, I, I could actually have to shut it down for a while, body-wise, so if that does happen, there's gonna be a shitload of athletic training stuff going on, and uh, I might just shrivel up for a little bit and just try to be an athlete. The muscle will come back. You know, you got muscle memory. Like I said, I'm at a point where I'm maintaining the size that I have, which is great. I'm up about 20 pounds from this time last year. Uh, with same if not better body composition. So I'm really happy with you know the way things have gone this year uh, as far as the size they put on and it'd be good to keep rolling into next year but I'm young and I don't want to push it and uh, health is priority right now so gotta get these little things taken care of and um, you know try to focus on life a little bit. Business is picking up like crazy. I got a ton of training clients now, some prep clients, plus a bunch of other projects on the side that I want to focus on. So uh, you know just kind of taking everything day by day enjoying life a little bit right now. So that's all for now. Like I said, we're gonna get some videos coming up in the next couple weeks doing some different shit, some outside lifestyle type, type stuff so you guys get to know me a little more, get to know my wife a little bit, and uh, see what makes us tick. So thanks for tuning in, and uh, we'll see you guys soon.